This is a story about a mouse trap. Ahoy! I'm Captain Rob Lee, and welcome to Pirate Lifestyle TV. Arr. <laughs> In this video, I am going to share a parable, a simple story about a mouse and a mouse trap, and show you that other people's problems, well, let's not spoil the story. A mouse looked through the crack in the wall to see the farmer and his wife opening a package. He was devastated to discover it was a mouse trap. Running to the farmyard, the mouse shouted the warning to the other animals. There's a mouse trap in the house. There's a mouse trap in the house. <laughs> the chicken clucked and raised her head, saying, Mr. Mouse, I can tell this is a serious concern for you, but it is of no consequence to me. I cannot be bothered with it. So the mouse turned to the pig and said to him, There is a mouse trap in the house. The pig sympathized, but said, I'm so sorry, Mr. Mouse, but there is nothing I can do about it but pray. The mouse turned to the cow, but she said, I'm sorry for you, Mr. Mouse, but it's no skin off my nose. The mouse returned to the house, head down and dejected, to face the farmer's mouse trap alone. That night, a sound was heard throughout the house, the sound of a mouse trap catching its prey. The farmer's wife rushed to see what was caught. In the darkness, she did not see that it was a poisonous snake whose tail was caught in the trap. The snake bit the farmer's wife. The farmer's wife developed a fever. Now, everyone knows how you treat a fever with fresh chicken soup so the farmer took his hatchet to the farmyard for the soup's main ingredient. But his wife's sickness continued, so friends and neighbors came to sit with the farmer's wife around the clock. To feed them, the farmer butchered the pig. The farmer's wife did not get any better and soon died. So many people came for her funeral that the farmer had the cow slaughtered to provide enough meat for all of them. So, what is the moral lesson of this parable? The next time you hear someone is facing a problem and you think that it is of no concern of yours, remember that when one person is threatened, we are all at risk. Whatever affects one, affects all. I hope you enjoyed this Pirate Lifestyle TV quickie. What is your favorite parable? With ye help, me goal be to motivate and stimulate ye friends to be living the pirate lifestyle. Arr. <laughs>